shooting in Durham played out just hours before the beginning of National Night Out. Many events are happening throughout our area, including this one you're about to see in Goldsboro. The family of 15 year old Joanna Pearsall is here. She's the girl killed at a pool party back in April. WRL's Destiny Patterson spoke with a family today who says it's time for someone to speak up. Joanna Pearsall's family says she was a dedicated volunteer. At Goldsboro's National Night Out at Herman Park, they're thinking of her as they hand out food free of charge. We're going to do what we do best, and that's support our community. It's a space to help law enforcement connect with the people they serve. We have to stand with them in this community to fight this issue that is going on. She's talking about gun violence. It's a topic that hits close to home for Maria Bell. She's still hoping police find the person responsible for her niece's death. This is time now for us to say, look, no more. Joanna was one of 16 shot at a pool party in April. She was the only person killed. Others at the party reported hearing dozens of rounds of gunfire and seeing more than 100 people running to safety. Today, Goldsboro police told me that there were no new developments, no new leads and no new suspects. That leaves the family still waiting for justice. We're hoping not just for Gianna, but for all other parents who have lost a child, lost a loved one, that somebody would come forth soon. Goldsboro PD is working for unsolved homicide cases from the past year and a half, two from 2022 and two from the first half of this year. Justice to me was to see that somebody come forth and says, I didn't mean to do it, but, I, but here I am. While they wait and pray for that justice, Bell says they'll continue working in the community with Joanna in mind. Destiny Patterson, WREL News, Goldsboro.